The Aces are in the finals for the first time. The Seattle Storm have won three WNBA titles. This best of five series is for all the marbles. It's a battle of the two best teams during the short and regular season inside the bubble in Bradenton, Florida. The Aces are in the top seed by beating Seattle in both of their meetings this season. Head coach Bill Lambert said this team really came together at the end of the season. We knew that coming down the last three games were going to be very, very tough, playing Minnesota and Los Angeles and then Seattle on a back-to-back. Um, we just hunkered down and, and came together as a team at that point in time and says, hey, let's go do it. And they did it. They won all three games, get the number one seed. Uh, I think that was a moment of clarity for our basketball team to understand, you know, they are, they are, they belong here right now. And they belong in this position where they're at. And now it's a matter of going out and throwing the ball up and see who wins. The Aces are already without two of their top players in Liz Cambage and Kelsey Plum, who did not play this season. And then De'Erica Hamby injured her knee in the semifinals, and that will be another key piece missing. But they do have the MVP in Asia Wilson and brought in veteran Angel McCountry, who has been in the finals before. You think about the experience, that the things you've learned, just like in life. What have you learned from your past? But you don't dwell on the past. You just take the experiences with you. The Aces have found a new home in Las Vegas, and they would love to be the first team to win a major professional championship in the city. Yeah, it would be dope. And the, the, the biggest thing with, with, with that is that we know that the city would embrace the hell out of us if we were able to do this. Um, you know, the love and, and support they give us, even from thousands of miles away, um, you know, and you, know, you, just, you just have that feeling of what it feels like to play in front of them um, night in and night out. Um, and you know that that's a large part of why we want to do this for for the city of Las Vegas. Game one is set for late afternoon on Friday with a four o'clock tip. Kevin Bollinger, Fox 5 News Local, Las Vegas.